the courageous priest, St. Raymond Nenadis. St. Raymond Nenadis, born in 1204 to a noble Spanish family, was destined for greatness. However, his father had other plans for him. Expecting Raymond to serve in the royal court and rejecting his desire to become a priest. Yet, as Psalm 37, 4 to 5 says, Delight yourself in the Lord, and he will give you the desires of your heart. Commit your way to the Lord, trust in him, and he will act. Welcome to our channel. Please like and subscribe. Thank you, and God bless you. Raymond's commitment to God led him to resist his father's plans, and he eventually joined the Mercedrians. As a priest, Raymond dedicated his life to ransoming slaves, even offering himself as a hostage to free another. His radical obedience to God's calling is a testament to the power of surrender. During his imprisonment, Raymond continued to preach, converting some of his guards. To silence him, his captors brutally bored a hole through his lips and attached a padlock. Yet, as Isaiah 57 says, But the Lord God helps me. Therefore I have not been disgraced. Therefore I have set my face like a flint. And I know that I shall not be put to shame. Raymond's unwavering faith and courage ultimately led to his release and return to Barcelona in 1239. That same year, Pope Gregory IX named him a cardinal. However, his life was cut short when he died in 1240 at the age of 36 while en route to Rome. Despite his short life, St. Raymond's legacy lives on as the patron saint of pregnant women, childbirth, and newborn infants. May his story inspire us to commit our ways to the Lord and trust in his plans. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. Thank you and God bless you.